The Cisco Lobos lead their district with a 4-1 record, but more importantly, a 2-0 district record. The Lobos haven't dropped a district game since 2011 and have won 49 straight, looking for their 50th this week. We're getting better every week. That's what I'm most impressed with is, is we, we can't fall off in a district as good as this one. We got to take every game seriously and we got to get better every single week. I feel good because the coaches always get us ready every week and uh, I always have a good game plan for, to come Friday night. Uh, it's just another game. Coach West has prepared us this week for uh, a, a Coleman team. You know, he puts a, a good game plan together. We just got to go out Friday night and execute to get that 50 straight win. Cooper's Noah Garcia and Holly's Colton Marshall have been the center point of running the ball this season, but the Lobos have gone unnoticed with their rushing attack this year. Cisco has totaled 1,033 yards on the ground. The only difference, five different guys have put together this number, showing their stellar team effort so far. Our line does an awesome job of getting us a big hole to run through, and uh, we just got to do our job and give what we can. And uh, it's, I mean, it's fun playing behind the line that gives a big hole in me. Makes, gives all the glory to the backs, but it's really the line doing all the credit. Yeah, we're pleased with it. You know, four members of that offensive line are new, so it was it's kind of an area that we weren't too sure how solid we would be early, especially early in the year. But that offensive line's growing up quick, and they're producing, and the backs are, are definitely benefiting from big holes. The Lobos take on the Coleman Blue Cats this Friday. Reporting at Cisco for BigCountryHomePage.com Sports, I'm Max Preston.